Hey, man, this is Aaron Zalmani, a yacht, young Zalmani, you know what it is, Voodoo Gang, VDG, and G, representing Medina, Accra, Ghana, and you know, yeah, we're really out here. I am on the earth, since day one, niggas try to pass me in, but I never been in. I am on the verge, don't push it, I know you feel the ends, no need to pretend, but you like come on. Ayat is Medina, and Medina is Ayat. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. That's that's all. I born and raised in Medina. All my education I had in Medina. Still in Medina. Family been in Medina. Medina boys, we we go after. We you know we chase after our dreams. We make it happen. What people know me by right now is trap and hip hop. If you understood the house of art, that's why like most of my my songs, I try to make it the house of art and the English part. So the English part is mostly like just what I'm saying in the house of parts and it's huge it's about challenging yourself being a you know a go-getter working for your dreams you understand love peace unity and thinking for yourself that's like most of the message in my song I want the sound to keep growing to keep getting better and not be like rapper I'm out here trying to you know murder everybody like that's not what I'm about right now. I'm just trying to be the best musician possible, like, you know, a real musician. That's what I'm out for right now. So my stagecraft, there's a lot that go into it. And it's not just like stagecraft, it's, you know, the body painting I, um, influence of the late great Falakuti. He's a, a huge influence of mine. And his songs has a lot of message in, in it, but you can play his songs at the club. That to me is amazing. So when I, whenever I get on stage, I make sure that it's an experience that you take home and talk about it, you understand? So the whole pyro effect goes with my energy. So when I go out there, like regardless whether they're going to rage with me, whether they're going to, you know, whatever the outcome is, I'm just going to be the best performer on, on that particular stage. Like I'm an inspiration to the Medina right now and there's a lot of stories like mine. There isn't much like support but then like this guy's from Medina he made it happen. This guy's from Medina he made it happen. So you know it's like a, a very inspirational story that is still being told. It's like it's like that we made the music we want and somehow the masses gravitated to it. But this year it's just like it's crazy. So the new wave Charlie is be very scary, be dangerous. And it's not just the musicians, it's like the photography, the directors, like everything. It's changing on all aspects. It's not even just on the music, musical side of things. Bro. All the arts is just changing. And like there's dope fresh ideas coming now. It's crazy, Charlie. I think in less than two to three years, Charlie, it'll be some dangerous scene. Yeah, very. The Zamani EP is a collection of 10 songs with uh, like production from the regulars um, I started working with, or I've been working with Keso, Kuvi. North, Magnum, and like it's just crazy because Zamani means more than in house up. I think that's my genre of music. My, mu my music is Zamani music, so yeah, like it's just more than music, but with like an underground feel and a mainstream appeal. I just I just think it's really dope, and everyone who's heard it, you know, some of it thinks it's amazing. So when it comes, I just put it out, and I hope you guys like it. But yeah. There's a couple of uh, really dope dope tracks on the Zamani EP. That's my debut EP too. The best is yet to come because I'm, I'm working. Since I don't feel any competition from anyone, which is not something I seek out for anyways, all I'm focused on is being the best me possible. And there's no pressure really. It's just like, I was just having fun with it. I never knew. I woke up one day and the sock verse was in my email. So, like, it, it was never planned. Like it just happened, so it's not something I'm going to be like, okay, right now it's all work, work. No, I'm just going to just let it happen, though, you know, let nature take its course and let the universe play this shit out for me. My mission is to let every kid know that you can do it. I mean, it's a cliche, but you know, you can do whatever you want to put your mind to it and never let, let it be a job. Just have fun with it. You understand? Whatever. It is you feel like you're passionate about go out there and do it once you're like 
serious about it or whatever it's just gonna happen for you so like that's you, it's just a cliche story but i feel like there's nothing else i can say because that's really what it's about just do you that's the whole mission be you be the best you possible for the world